YDOT's first web camera was installed on the I-80 Summit in the late 90s and quickly became popular. Today, 182 cameras on 33 different routes provide a glimpse of road conditions across the state. A valuable tool used by YDOT's Transportation Management Center, web camera feeds are also publicly available through 511 Travel Information Services. And those are updated about every three minutes. You can see the weather and the road conditions upstream and downstream of the camera, as well as um, on the road surface. We try to provide a close shot of the surface so that you can see in that location um, what the weather is doing. YDOT adds web cameras based on need and budget the department also sets up cameras at special construction locations. Typically, we try to put them on uh, maintenance section breaks so that um, crews from each section can look at the cameras and see how the roads are. And we'll also identify problem areas and install web cameras in those areas so that we can keep an eye on uh, the weather. As YDOT's remote instrumentation expands, so does the information it provides. Detailed local conditions are now available from 89 roadside weather stations. I think one of the most important pieces of information would be the wind gust information because it does affect travel, especially with light and high profile vehicles. Remember, if there's ice and snow, take it slow and always buckle up. This is Doug McGee reporting.